Ah, it's all about product placement. <laughs> Aloha Water, a fine sponsor of the D Las Vegas' Tiny TV here on OC16. I uh, want to thank them as well as Lex Brody's. Always get my tires going. Uh, they also do all the checking on your car, everything. Like my Tony vehicle, got my Rogue for a couple of years now. I always exchange and get new ones because the Tony Group, best dealership. And uh, we want to mention McKinney Car Wash because they keep my car clean and they're right on Kapiolani. Best of the best every year. I want to thank them for sponsoring my show as well. But uh, I'm trying to drink more water nowadays. Plus they got the negative ions and they got the regular stuff. For your home office and now in this handy it's a 16.9 fluid ounce bottle since ono hello water now you're probably wondering why am i here in this parking lot this is where there's like frost city you guys heard of this place before you know they got like that snow ice thing but they also have in the same shopping complex ahi assassins i'm going to show you like some unreal poke dip and poke and windward guys where i'm from and they're hidden in this little area. But where exactly? Let's back out further. Let's go out on King Street and I'll show you where we're at. Okay, I can take off my glasses now. This is the corner of University and King Street. Okay, this is like right at that busy intersection. Uh, Pucks Alley used to have East Side Grill, remember that? University is up there. Uh, there it goes up toward uh, Kamuki Wailai area. And uh, th that's FedEx, everybody knows that building. You know where we are, right? Blazing Steaks right in this complex. And if we walk this way, Long's is there. Uh, the um, health, health place down to earth. My friends, Yugo Life is there by Subway. Keep going and then there's Long's Bank of Hawaii, Burger King, even Jiffy Lube is right around the corner. But this is the shopping center. You're gonna turn in and they have a pedicure place. There's Copy Hut. My friend David Miyachi owns that. Copy Hut, very popular, good prices. But everybody knows Frost City. And I guess two high guys, kind of popular place. But upstairs is Ahi Assassins. Okay, we're gonna go inside, but you know what I saw before we go inside? They're taking a load of fish. I mean, these guys go fishing all the time, every day. Now, this is this a good size? Yeah, these are about 40 pounders. Woo! They're, they're the medium-sized ones, but they're perfect for the pokey and stuff. I'm telling you, this is like, I can still feel like they're going to kick a little bit. These are coming up the stairs. Up here. Okay, well, we'll meet you upstairs in the shop. Okay, now we're upstairs. Apparently, it's called the East-West Building. And you can see we're right here at where I told you about Ahi Assassins. We'll give you their phone number again, but just in case you want to write it down now because you trust me, you're going to want to call them, 439-4045. And you know what, they've got like hot specials, cold items, everything. Erica's kind of cruising outside. Erica, I was gonna ask you, you guys have like different hours. You guys are closed on a couple days a week, right? Yes, we're closed Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Our boats are fishing, so the shop is closed down. Wednesday through Saturday, 11 to seven, so come check us out. Okay, in fact, she had to scold me once because I came in when they were closed. She said, we're closed, <laughs> come back later. Now they've got customers coming all the time in and out, you're gonna see while we're filming. How's it, Josh? How's it? What is this? This is a fresh big eye, about 60 pounds. Woo. Locally caught here, hand line fishing. Okay, now the thing we want to push is that it's it's fresh, even when you cook it, everything is made to order, right? Everything is made to order. Whenever we run out of one type of poke, if we have fresh cubes, we'll mix it fresh for you. Okay. We don't like to keep everything all saucy all day because it gets all marinated and you'd rather see that color. Now we're watching you like cut it right now. You're a professional at this. How many years have you been fishing? I've been fishing since I came out of the womb. <laughs> I think I might have even been made on the boat. <laughs> you, know, you know, there's water in the placenta, so you were like a fish. <laughs> now, um, Saltwater age. Your whole family, in fact, I, I got you the other day, you guys were in here and then you, you and your brother and your dad, you guys went out to go catch fish. Yeah, so we went out yesterday, came back this morning with a boatload of tuna. And uh, that's why we opened this store, so we can bring fresh local fish. Now, the rest of it, you're gonna cut Filet style? Cut filets, we cut loins off of it to uh, make all of our dishes here. Our pan seared ahi, our poke and sashimi is all cut from the same loin. Mm -hmm. There's no hiding it. Some people may uh, think that we use the lesser grade for our cooking grade. It's all the same fish. We need to get rid of it fresh. We need to get that money turned around so we can put fuel back in our boats. The faster we get it off their boat, the faster you take it, the faster we can go back out and get you some more. 
Okay, now we're watching you kind of cut it, the fresh fish, but uh, yesterday we're down here and you were actually making poke out of aku. Yes, fresh aku is like the Hawaiian staple. Most poke shops that opened 40, 50 years ago always served aku. Aku was a fish that you could get daily. Every time you go out, you catch a handful of aku. It's a little scarce nowadays, mm -hmm. but when we do get it, we like to blast it on our Instagram, Facebook, so all our local people can come out and get their aku fix. Now we're watching you put it together on the uh, video from yesterday, and, and what's the secret sauce? Is there anything or is it basic? The aku that we make is real basic for that type that we mixed yesterday. is a Hawaiian style with inomona, red alai salt, sesame, and green onion. But yeah. there is some we loving tender care. You, you're putting something extra in there because you kind of know how much. Yeah, it's been passed down for generations how to prepare. We're the fishermen. The fishermen are always the guys that come out and support all of our friends when they have a party, baby luau, wedding. You get the call. and. When it's family and friends, you volunteer and you take care of it. And the chili pepper sauce really made it happen too. The chili peppers are grown fresh in Kahalu. We bring them straight from home and bust them up right here. Right. Doesn't get any uh, from farm to table than that, huh? Now, are you part Filipino the way you're working that night? <laughs> Erica's the Filipino one, okay. so maybe... I'm, I'm going to go talk to her then. And we got some uh, more local people coming in for the fresh fish. How's it, brother? So Erica, tell us about your extensive menu. You guys seem to have lots of stuff up there. I mean, they can choose from. Yeah, so that is our list of fresh poke. None of it is ever frozen. If we do not have poke, we close it out for the day. But those are all our, I guess, seasoning, spices, whatever you want. Also, we do specialized poke for you. So if you want something without onions, we'll gladly do it. And that's aku bone. Today, this is ahi. but. On occasions, we will have aku. Whatever we're catching, that's what's in our menu. Okay, well, I'm going to show the aku bone because I have a picture of it on my Facebook from uh, my former player at Little League, Sean Clairball. That was a very nice piece he made. So people can come up and, and just get it raw like this and cook it at yes, home. Yes, it is $5 a pound. So you could get bones, bellies, collars, oh. even quarter loins if you'd like. Okay. Now, Erica, tell us about some of these popular items we got. So this is definitely our number one seller as far as our hot items. This is our baked ahi stuffed with crab. This is all ahi belly, so it's nice and juicy, succulent, a lot of flavor for you. This is our traditional Hawaiian. Wait, wait, you gotta have furukake on the rice there. Yes, 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 absolutely. Now this is gonna be our $7 poke bowl. You cannot go wrong with this. This is our traditional Hawaiian style. It has inamona, ogo inside, Hawaiian salt, and a few other things. Now our lastly, this is what we're known for. This is our smoked ahi dip. It does transfer over between ahi and marlin. Um, whatever we're catching, that's what's in our dip. That's what my son comes for. That's how I found that out about favorite. this place. Yeah, yeah, that's his favorite. All right. Tell us about the sustainability, time. about the, the business like that. So all of our fish is hook and line caught, one fish at a time. We do not have unwanted bycatch. At some points, different fisheries, they catch the dolphins, turtles, whales, things like that. We, I can honestly say I've never caught a whale, never caught a dolphin, <laughs> and never caught a turtle. So. We decide also what size. So if this size here has had a chance to reproduce, and then we'll take it. But if we're catching pan size, we don't really like those. They don't have a chance to reproduce. We don't want to shoot ourselves in the foot and have no fish for our kids in the next generation. So it's like the commercial when the guy caught the 12 fish, but he threw some back in the water. Exactly. <laughs> we, right. we catch hundreds of fish, and maybe 20% makes the cut. Okay. We like that. They're green. Now, Henry's in the back here hiding, but he's a local boy jamming and cooking and he's making so plates. I was like, where are you in school? Castle. Hey, okay. I'm glad. We've got Kanuwa boys here and Kainua guys and Kaleo. We're looking at our baked dolly right now. Okay. Now, how often are you here to make this? Are you here early in the morning? Um, Yeah. It's freshly made every day. And you seem to be very generous on the slabs of meat you're putting in these plates. Yeah. Being a local boy from Kanua, you know, right? <laughs> yep, you got, got that. Gotta have big pieces. What, what year are you grad? 79. 79. Okay, I'm trying to think. No, was was I born? Yeah, were you born yet? <laughs> nah, nah. I'm an 81. I'm an 81 <laughs> grad. Okay, so, okay, furukake and the rice again, a nice slab here. Can you tell us what, what's in there to make it so good? Oh, uh, we have ahi belly, uh, imitation crab, fresh mushrooms, and minis. All right. It sounds like we can do it, but it doesn't come out like yours. <laughs> but thank you for sharing some of this, and uh, 
being here at Ahi Assassins. In our tiny little kitchen. Yes, I love it. It's a tiny little seafood restaurant. A it's hole everything. In the wall, they won't put a hole in your pocket. A <laughs> hole in the wall, they won't put a hole in your pocket. It's Ahi Assassins Fish Company. As they say, it's right on 2570 Veritania. There's their phone number. Don't move, Josh. Okay. I'm getting the phone number. Okay, and it's 439 4045. Call them just to make sure they're open if you want, or what they got, if it's Aku or Ahi or whatever, if they answer, because they're so busy. But no, they'll answer. Look at all this fish. This is great. All right here in Hawaii. All right. <laughs>